Well, hey everyone, so welcome back to another Triple B unboxing. Um, Triple B stands for Big Brown Box Day. Now, because I was in Florida, I received the box, and the box has kind of been sitting to the side for a couple days because we're trying to get um, kind of getting resettled after a vacation, even though it was a short vacation. Um, but that's going to be in a different video on that, on that little trip. So, I do want to kind of give a um, kind of an update on my last costume that I talked about. Um, in my last Big Brown Box video, I received from Jason Hill uh, and Imperial and Galactic Supply the, um, the chest box for the Rebel X-Wing uh, pilot, the original trilogy. So, happy to say that the costume has been finally approved. Um, the My character, I am now approved through the Rebel Legion, which is awesome. Um, most likely will probably be my only costume with the Rebel Legion. Don't quote me on that, you, you know, months and years later. But um, as of right now, that's probably the only Rebel costume I'm ever going to do. Because uh, I'm more of an Empire guy. But, um, of course, even my x-wing helmet which right here uh, is black so with like just like my uh, tie pilot helmet so um th the cool thing i will say about the rebel legion and i know this is this is a unboxing video but the cool thing about the rebel legion is you don't get a number unlike the file of first you have a number which follows you and you just for every costume you add um a two Two letters from the alphabet T I T D T K and so forth the rebel legion you kind of can build your own character unless it's an actual original tr uh, uh, rebel or resistance character you can kind of create your own character and that's what I did with my x-wing pilot uh, my character is lieutenant hop so real quick you know the, um, the backstory for my X-Wing pilot. Um, numerous year Empire, Imperial TIE fighter pilot and becomes disenchanted with the Empire, sees what you know the Empire is doing to people and everything, decides to defect. He defects, joins the Rebel Legion, and you know, just like you know, you have your number, well you don't really get and go by a name. You just went by your number, so he decided to take his 40981. He took the 409, switched it the, the 4 to an H, the 0 to a O, the uh, 9 to a P, and you got Hop. So there's Lieutenant Hop. So, but like I said, it's uh, finally officially been approved. So I'm really, really excited about it. So let's get into the unboxing. So I'm going to get, there you go, a little bit more official now so again um this uh unboxing this is from galactic supply and um now i have already um cut the box open just because it will take less time to you know you don't want to see me actually cutting a box open so i've actually got two things i've got the compad and the box well do the box first so First of all, I said Big Brown Box Day. Well, this is really more of a big orange question mark box, which um, that's something I saw these was at um, Wizard World uh, when it was up in Richmond. So I'm, it'd be interesting where he actually got the box. So uh, what's in the box is the ATST driver helmet. Of course, you do see the ATST really quick in. Empire Strikes Back. One of my, this is my favorite episode. So, but you, you briefly see the ATST walking under, you know, just past the the AT, at walkers. But you never see the driver until Return of the Jedi. So my next costume is the ATST driver. So um, I did get this um, complete. It's not a kit, so. Um, I'm, I'm not really comfortable, like I said, in, in 
uh, my video talking about the file first. I'm not comfortable with making, I'm, I'm always scared to make mistakes. So sometimes it's just, I, I like the idea of just, hey, go, just go ahead and get it already made. So here's the uh, ATSD helmet and I'm gonna set it down on the ground so I can open it up. We'll say it comes very well packaged with the bubble wrap. It comes completely wrapped up, which I love. It's, you know, like, I, like I've said before with Jason Hill's products, he, I mean, not only does he take time um, oops, what just fell? Oh, okay. This is the uh, the antenna. Set the box aside. So, all right. So, there's the helmet. Um, I could, I, I, you could smell the paint, which that's, I love that smell. Um, let me. I'm gonna take the antenna out. Again, just like the Imperial Gunner helmet, um, he's put a wing nut on on the back of this, so that way I can attach it to the helmet. So for transportation purposes, um, you can. That way, you, you know, you don't risk breaking it, which um, that's what I, I really like. The fact that, you know, he's he's taking it, again, an extra step to where, you you know, he knows 501st members or or uh, Rebel um, Rebel Legion members will just, you know, they, they, they put them in cases and transport. So there's the, uh, with the antenna on top. Um, Ken has got the, the Imperial Greeblies. It's got the backbone. Um, the only thing I'm going to have to add is helmet pads on the inside because actually with the hat on, it doesn't really look bad. So, um, yeah, so really the only thing I have left to do with this um, with this costume is getting the the goggles, which again under the comp, the um, the reference library, you, they're a particular type of um, rectangular uh, goggles and everything, which I found on Amazon. So begin knows. Um, hopefully they're the right type, but uh, but yeah, this is very well done. Can't wait to get this. And the here's the, here's the great thing about the ATST driver. Um, again, it's one of those costumes where I've already got the boots because the boots are the same boots for the TIE pilot, the, the bridge crewman, TIE pilot reserve, and the X-wing pilot, the gloves, same gloves as the, all the, the costumes I just mentioned. So, and the belt and the belt. So what all else do I need other than the goggles I need the flight suit the flight suit is different uh, which um, once they come in back in stock I will be getting the Wampa wear um, gray flight suit um, I went with when I did my X-wing pilot I went with the Wampa wear um, my tie pilot and all the costumes I went with it it's a cosplay sky which it was great when I first with Starter's costumes, now I, I'm going to upgrade to Wumpa Wear. I love it. Um, instead of an X, uh, two, 2X, I'm going with a 3X because I'm a little bit more beefier up here um, and it's a little bit easier to get off. So um, Now, the other thing I'm going to have, I have to, had to get different was um, the Compad. The Compad is different from the, uh, the TIE Pilot and Bridge Crewman and the uh, X-Wing pilot. Now, so I went to Wampa Wear again. That's like my go-to. And got my uh, uh, 
comp pad, so it's just a, it's a little bit different. Um, it's the same color as the X-Wing pilot, but the buttons are different. Um, of course, they just came out with something in regards to the X to the Tie pilot and all those costumes where um, the the button and stuff is a little bit different around here. So, but hope I shouldn't. I should I because I'm already approved. My, my current comp pad um, is good but so other than the flight suit this and my goggles the the costumes already done but again um, awesome I, I and Jason like I said Jason Hill just does this quality work and if you ever consider um, getting and starting a costume I gotta go through galactic supply um, it, it's, um, I can't speak highly enough. I mean, it's, um, and he's not, again, he's not telling me how to, he's not telling me to, you know, he's not sponsoring me or anything. It's just, I love his product. He, he just shows, shows you that he, his love for Star Wars. Um, of course, he's also got how to videos. So he's not, he's not afraid to tell you, Hey, this is how I make my, my, tie pilot helmets he he had like a six part series on how to make it uh, his tie pilot helmet so he's not afraid to show you hey this is how i make them and uh honestly that you know would bring in more business because you know hey i'm seeing how he's making it and you know again it's quality so um so yeah so i wanted to do the unboxing of the new new costume that's coming up um of course with the um uh with the ATST driver, um, if I take the helmet off, wear the hat, take off the gloves, um, I think I've got another costume. I think it's the uh, scanning crew. Um, so again, there's you know basically two costumes with one um, flight suit. So so yeah. So um, if you got questions, put them down in the comments below um, you know, during the live broadcast and stuff um, that Timmy and I um, will ever do. Um, or our next one or you, other ones down the road um let me know if you got questions and of course i'm going to link um intergalactic supply um in the uh, description down below um and also you could follow him on you know through facebook instagram uh jbh66 on instagram so uh with that being said appreciate you joining me for this unboxing and a little bit of an up update on the x-wing pilot um once once i get that costume done i'll you know probably do another uh up uh update of course probably be alive and everything but that being said thanks for watching this discussion is over